How's it everybody? Celtic Link here. We're back for another Dokkan battle video. It is that time again. We have the 66th virtual Dokkan Ultimate Clash. So we've got another category challenge guide here. We're going to be taking on the various stages using various categories themed to the style of the fight as well as stepping it up a notch from our last category challenges um not only are we going to attempt to clear each stage for the specific category we're going to try to keep that within the typing that is type advantage to the fight that we're doing um obviously we have a few backup teams in case we fail but the goal is to get all the way through using these typing so if you would like to join in we will put the various categories in the description down below but kicking things off here we're gonna hop on into stage one here against the agl jocko uh, as always with our category challenges we kick off the first couple of events using our major free-to-play team so we can save up our bigger badder stronger units for later in the fight so up first we got jocko um, pretty easy. He's got a little bit of damage reduction. He can be sealed, can be stunned. So let's go ahead. I think for this one, we'll just go ahead. We'll use Ginyu Force. <coughs> <coughs> or not Bardock. Ginyu Force. Where is that? There they are. Okay, so we'll use Ginyu Force for this one. We'll use our free to play team. So that way we can save our leads and our stronger units for later. <clears throat> All right. Let's grab that. Let's take that. And let's send off the raccoon here. Oh, kicking it off with a super. Okay, not a good way to start. <clears throat> <clears throat> All right, now having the fizz attack first means everybody else on the rotation is going to get a buff. And it just means we're going to get done with this that much faster. Perfect. All right. So first stage down. So stage one with the Ginyu Force, it's pretty much a given. Honestly, for the first couple of stages, you can use anybody you want. doesn't really matter. But the goal is to try this out, have a little fun with it. We all know how monotonous the battlefield can get. So let's go ahead. We're going to use Team Bardock for this one. All right. Let's go here. There we go. We're going to use our free-to-play setups here. Alright, let's grab that with Shugesh, and let's pray that the AGL Bardock doesn't have to take any damage that he doesn't need to take. He's probably the weakest member of this team. There we go. Getting... Alright, at least we know there's no super, and it is on Fasha, who of course doesn't dodge here, but it's alright. Perfect. We get an additional normal. Another additional normal. Oh, wow, he still takes kind of a lot of damage there. Okay. All right, let's grab that so we can get the uh, attack and defense buff for having them attack first. And we'll grab that with Borgos. Perfect. Excellent. So Team Bardock takes down stage one. So like I said, for stage one and stage two, you want to use your free-to-play teams so that way you can save your stronger teams for later in the fight. So we got that one down. All right, that's going to bring us here into level two. So we're actually going to take down Fizz TN first. 
And for this one, we're actually going to use Wicked Bloodline, and we are going to run these guys here. Alright, um, well, we are mainly type disadvantage here, that's okay, we do have some type advantage, but, I mean, it's not going to be too terribly difficult. Alright, um, let's grab that. Alright, so, hopefully... Um, uh, not exactly what I want to see, but it's all right. We get the additional super, very nice. At least the Int Metal Cooler army doesn't have to take a super. Nice. Triple super with the STR Metal Cooler. We should be all right on the super attack here. Oh yeah, perfect. All right, there's one attack, we get a normal. We get an extra super, very nice. All right, here we go, and then the other STR metal cooler. Perfect, it is enough to take him down. So like I said, first three stages, utilize your free-to-play teams any order as long as you can get him them done, just to get it out of the way so you can focus your categories on further. So first up, we have the Int Krillin. Um, we can be, we can seal him and that's pretty much it. So we're actually gonna go with a team that I thought would be fun for Krillin and that is Peppy Gals. So we're going to go Fizz, Peppy Gals here. Um, we're going to put Launch as our leader because she's 130. And then I think Fasha is the other leader. Yeah, Fasha. Okay. And then we're going to load up with these these guys here. So Fizz, Peppy Gals to take down Krillin. So like I said, in this for this one, uh, I'm going to put the in the description the various categories we use. Alrighty, perfect. Alright, now we're putting Fasha in front because she does need to be hit to be built uh get built up. Alright, not bad, we get the additional super. Perfect. All right, nice. And we did bring Rebello. She is Dragon Ball Heroes, but she does have a chance to dodge. And okay, she takes double digits post super. And we did seal, so we don't have to worry about a super attack this turn. All right, how are we looking here? I guess pretty much the same no matter what. All right, um, let's grab that. Grab that. And off the off chance he somehow survives, we'll have eight keys here with Kefla. Now he is sealed, so he cannot attack us. So launch actually might finish up here. There we go. Perfect. Okay. So there you have it. First stage down that matters. We got Krillin done with Happy Gals. So in the comments after we clear each stage, hey, let me know what's the setup you used for this event. Up next, we have the Extreme STR Super Baby one. So I had a fun one with this one. We're going to go Goku's family, since he did fight Goku after all. Um, or actually, no, 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 no. For this one, uh, I, I'm using Goku's family for a different one. Um, for this one, let's go... Where is it? Uh... Um, artificial life forms. Yeah, perfect. This is the setup I want to use. So we're actually going to do this, this, um, right? He's power absorption. He's on power absorption, right? Yes, he is. That's what I thought. Okay. So this is the setup we're going to run here. Um, we're going to see if this works. Should be fun. 
Alright, what is he? Target Goku androids. Oh, no. No, no, no. Okay, you need to be off. It's you, right? Yep. Okay, there we go. Is he 120 or 130? 120. Okay, let's put him. There we go. Okay, that's the setup. Yeah, it doesn't matter. It's Extreme AGL 130. Yep. Okay, let's go ahead. Let's hop on in and let's do this. That did not work out how I thought there. Alright, the nice thing is Boo is actually super strong. He might actually help us with this fight. Oh, jeez, okay. Boo solos. <laughs> I was not anticipating. Alright, so artificial life forms is the category for the super baby one. Boo solos, that's all you need to know. Alright, and like I said, uh, at the end of each stage, let us know what team you use to clear, and, see, you know, we would love to hear what you guys did. But make sure you check the description for each category if you want to be one step ahead of me. So up next, we're going to take on the Super Int Goku with a Space Traveling Warriors team. And I think you all know why we're doing this one. Simply so we can do this number here um let's see so we're gonna have to put him there we go all right space traveling warriors that's yeah okay this should work all right we're actually gonna turn on animations i'm glad he didn't show up slot one Who's got the higher defense? Neither one. Okay. We might actually want to put Raditz in front. Funny enough. Okay. Perfect. Okay, this will work. Oh. Well, alright. <laughs> I mean, sad to say that. I mean, it's probably a good thing we put Raditz there. Oh, man. I... Wow. Raditz, you suck. Okay. So, that didn't work out. We actually had a... I mean, that was, that was probably the worst start we could have had for this. So, let's go ahead and use one of our secondary categories. We always bring backup categories for these. So, if you can't clear with... Um, one of your categories, uh, if you can't clear it as what happened here, you know, go ahead and drop in. Use one of your backup categories. So for me, I'm bringing Dragon Ball Heroes Extreme. You could use whatever you want. Let us know what you end up using in the... Um, Oh, that's right. You don't need to be there. You need to be there. Perfect. Okay. Let us know what you end up using in the description. If you can actually do it with a better Space Traveling Warriors team... Um, it didn't really work out in our favor, but that's okay. Alrighty, so this is actually a much, much better setup. There we go. Perfect. Uh, and then now he's gonna seal Crimson Mask King. Oh no, okay, or stun rather, but he didn't get it. He just got it on Raditz when it actually mattered. He's actually hitting really hard here. There we go. All right, now we don't need to worry about those super attacks anymore. Not helping when our units don't get the attacks that they need, though. All 
Alright, let's grab that. Perfect. Alright, now this guy's probably not going to do a whole lot of... Well, okay, yeah, he's going to do no damage, because apparently Kid Goku can dodge. Wow. Really? There we go. Alright, here we go. So this should take him pretty close to dead. It, I mean, well, okay, never mind. Alright, we get an additional super. At least he doesn't dodge the second one. There we go. Man, he'd have been dead if we'd have landed both of those. What is going on with these dodges on this guy? There we go. We get an additional normal. Alright, let's see. Alrighty, hopefully... I, I feel like we're not going to do anything here. This is going to be... We, we're, we definitely need to get that seal on Toa. There we go, we got it. Okay, so now we don't have to worry about Broly accidentally eating a super. Okay, why is this dude not getting additional supers? This dude is beefy today, what's going on? Alrighty, so let's grab that. Let's grab that. Perfect, this all worked out. How does this kid keep surviving? Jeez. Okay, we got the final super here. Alrighty, that takes down the first stage here. Perfect. Alright, let's go ahead. Let's jump into the next one. So for this one, this is the category we're going to use Goku's family for. And it's going to be an AGL typing. So let's do this number. Those are going to be our two leads. Uh, we're going to bring this guy. Yeah. Yeah, let's do this number. Okay. Alright, let's grab that. Perfect. Alright, so this should work. Uh, of course we don't get the dodge. Does bro cancel dodge? What is going on?
We didn't dodge a single attack. Does he cancel dodge? How is it possible we didn't dodge a single one of those attacks? Alright, let's grab that. Take that. And then, perfect. Okay. So, I mean, at least this rotation is kind of okay. I mean, not as much as I'd like, but... There we go, we take that. We get the super with the LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Do a bit of damage. There we go, we get an additional normal with the Goku here. We get the extra super. Remember, this guy... He does raise attack. There we go. Alright, let's grab that. Let's do this number. How is bro living? What is going on here? Alright, let's do this. There we go. Now we're dodging. Okay, so he doesn't cancel dodge. We just had really bad luck last turn. There we go. Much better. Perfect. Alright, so we take down the Demon King Piccolo. With AGL Goku's family, like I said before, when you clear a stage along with us, let us know the team you used in the comments down below. So we're going to take on Piccolo now, and for this one, we're going to go with Worthy Rivals. So really, the only way to do this is with Vegeta's family. So, um, let's see here. Let's do this. So, Pure Sands, Vegeta's family. Um, do do and do yeah let's do the trick all right let's do it all right so this is a worthy rival setup even though we are using um even though we are using uh mostly vegeta's family type characters Alright, we're still gonna hit out that 10 million, even though he decided to heal himself before we ever did any damage. That's the kind of luck we're having tonight. Alright, well, at least he supers here, which we know will tank. Yeah, there's the attack that we needed. Nice. Hopefully this god Vegeta does okay here, since he already took a super, the only thing we have to worry about is normals. That's not too bad. That could be much worse. Alright, let's grab that. Alright. There's one. Uh, well, actually, I think I think he's the best to have taken this on this team. Ooh, come on! We just need to survive. 
Uh, I don't think we can do this. Nope. Okay, so that didn't work out because bad super. Like, he'd literally been dead if he didn't heal himself on that turn, <laughs> but okay. Alright, so there goes one team down, unfortunately. So let's go. We'll use our secondary team here. So... Dragon Ball Heroes, once again, I, I always like to just keep these guys as backup. It gives me an excuse to kind of work them in to use when we haven't used them in a while. Really? Really? We are getting some of the worst starting luck I've ever had on a battlefield, my goodness. There we go. Oh, and we get the counter. Nice. Perfect. We get an additional super with the Goku. So I think this takes down the Kami Piccolo here. Yes, it does. Perfect. All right, so shame we didn't get to complete with two of those categories there. We could have easily done it if he decided he didn't want a super right there. Or, I mean, if he had actually just attacked the person we needed him to attack. All right, so the next one up for the cell is Time Travelers. So let's set this up. We're going to run a full Int Time Travelers team. So uh, we're going to use... This is going to be the setup we use. It'll basically cover everybody that's here. Perfect. Alright, let's go ahead and let's start by utilizing uh, Trunks' domain here. We're not fighting here in West City. I'm taking this fight somewhere else. Perfect. Alrighty, so... Um... Wow, really? Alright, let's do that. Let's get the seal off. Perfect. Okay, so this should actually work out quite nicely. Another time T decides to heal before anything happens now. Um, we do have a Power Beyond Super Saiyan ally on the team, so we should be getting the extra super here. Yes, perfect. And it is a seal, so we don't have to worry about any uh, super attacks. Nice. No extra super there, but it is still pretty good. Alright, so... Did you just dodge before or attacking? After attacking. Oh yeah, it's after attacking. Okay. Alright, let's put that there. Grab that, and then let's grab that with her. Uh, it still did a lot more than I wanted it to. Alright, there we go. Not too bad, that could have been worse. Alright, give me an extra super or two here. Okay, we'll take an attack lower. There we go. Extra super. Nice. Alright, and now we should be able to dodge from the cell. Ooh, we got the stun off. Nice. You think this is the end? Think about the next threat. Or think about your pride. Saiyan blood flows in your veins. 
If you're my son, as you claim, then I won't tolerate you losing to anyone! I will get stronger. Stronger than the enemy, and stronger than you! Alrighty, excellent. So, now, let's do this number. Um... Really? Alright, well, I guess we just take that, we do that number, and then we send off the Bardock, so... I was hoping we would be able to get the 18 key with these guys, but that's okay. There we go. We get the additional super still. Alright, now, no power beyond Super Saiyan this turn, which means probably only getting one Super. Yep. Yeah. Alright, now we transform with Goku Black. Alright, let's do this number. Let's grab that. Let's grab that. Perfect. There we go, we get an additional super with Goku Black. Oh man, we were so close there, but that's okay. The Int LR will finish up for us. Perfect. All right, so there is the tech cell cleared with int time travelers So far so uh, pretty easy on most of these stages There's only one that or two that really cut us off guard and It's really just because we were you know, we didn't really get a good starting rotation So for this one since it is the final stage of a specific celebration We are going to use the main characters that were you released this time around so let's see if we can find it movie heroes so we're gonna run movie heroes we're gonna run the lr gods as lead we're gonna bring this guy even though he's type disadvantage because i want to see um i want to see if we can actually stand by with him and use it so let's grab all this and this perfect all right so i think we got our team here actually let's take vegeta off here and let's bring orange piccolo Yes. Okay, this should work. Okay, perfect. So... Let's grab that. Let's grab that. Perfect. Okay, so this might actually work out alright. Okay, not with Nat starts turn one, though. Wow, that still did almost 200k. Hey, there we go. Look at that, 11 mil. Now, if we can get the crit, that'll be looking real nice. There we go. We'll take that. All right, post super is actually looking okay. Nice. All right, we get a whole bunch of supers with the Gohan and Goten this one. Ooh, wow, okay, I had a feeling with him supering at slot one, I had a feeling he was gonna super again slot uh, in the last slot there. But with all the supers we did, we actually tank it pretty well. All right, let's grab that. 
grab that. And let's grab that. So, I mean, realistically, it's entirely possible we just finish this phase right here. Nice. Now we did bring along God Goku since this is a pure Saiyan. He has his guaranteed extra damage reduction. Alrighty, excellent. Okay, so... Through this number... Alright, let's grab that, and we can get the 18 key with the gods. Not perfect, but it'll do. Alright, can we get a crit with Goku this time? There we go. Oh, that was so close to finishing him off. Alright, looks like the LA guys are going to finish up, but can we dodge this? Because otherwise this is going to hurt. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. And there we go. First try, we got the clear for the level 3 for this month's virtual ultimate clash we got the 66th ultimate clash and honestly we did pretty good right when we look at our teams here that we ran they actually ran pretty smoothly there were only two major exceptions and that's because one of our secondary leads was a 130 lead and you know we just had really bad placement on those super attacks so hopefully we can try again some other time and maybe next month's challenge and not be such a difficult task but for those of you who followed along and you want to attempt yourself here just uh let us know in the comments down below check the description for the details for each stage and give it a shot so guys that is it for the video if you like the video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you have not already. And like I said, in the comments down below, let us know what teams you use to clear the various missions. Okay, guys, that's it for the video. If nothing else, aloha.